Okay, this is going to be a review of Winchester Defender. This is a 12 gauge, 2 and 3 quarter inch shotgun shell. And this is, here's the box right here. So Winchester Defender, 2 and 3 quarter inch, 12 gauge. And this is the ammo that has the 1 ounce slug and 3 pellets of double out buckshot. So you can see that on the uh, package there. Let me flip it around. So here's a picture of basically what it's supposed to look like in the shell there. So you have three pellets sitting on top of a one ounce rifled slug. So you're sending four projectiles uh, instead of uh, just one slug or you know eight or nine pellets a buck. You're sending three pellets a buck and a one ounce slug. So this was shot out of a Mossberg 500 with a 20 inch smooth bore barrel. So let's go ahead and take a look at how it did. And here at five yards, you can see it's uh, pretty tight, four inch spread. So you have, you know, a pellet there, a pellet there, a pellet here, and a slug kind of in the middle. So it basically makes like a triangle with the slug right in the middle. So, you know, uh, double out, double out, double out, and a one ounce slug right in the middle. Five yards, looks pretty good. Going back to 10 yards, opens up a little bit. So we're at nine inches. And again, it's basically a triangle going from here to there to there. There's your three pellets of double out buck and a one ounce slug right in the middle. So at nine inches at 10 yards really isn't that bad, especially when the center of it is a one ounce rifle slug. That's a lot of energy there. So going to 15 yards, it actually is a little bit tighter than it was at 10 yards. So we had uh, nine inches at 10 yards. Here we only have eight inches. But, uh, you know, there's always a variance when you're shooting out of a uh, smooth bore with no choke or anything. So, like I said, we're at 8 inches. So we have a, you know, triangle here at Buckshot, 8 inch spread. Then the slug's actually outside a little bit. But still, in an 8 inch hole, you have 3 pellets, a double out buck, and a 1 ounce slug. So that's uh, still holding together pretty decent. Going out to 20 yards, opens up a little bit more. We're at 13 inches, and again, we're back to the way it looked before, where we kind of have a triangle. So three pellets of your double out buck right there, and then the slug is right in the center. So again, three pellets, a double out buck, and a one ounce slug right in the center. So that's still a pretty hefty payload being delivered in a relatively small area, 13 inches. Going out to 25 yards. Spreads out another four inches, which just really isn't that bad. But uh, again, we have the triangle here. So that's a 17 inch triangle. So we have one, two, three pellets, double out buck. And right in the center again is that one ounce rifled slug. So, you know, this is, uh, this is kind of neat ammo. I've never, uh, never shot it before. It's an interesting concept. You have a, you have a slug and the buckshot. So, you know, if you're uh, loading up a shotgun, a lot of guys load buckshot and keep slugs in their side saddle or something if they need to do a change out. Uh, this might be an ammunition that you could just load it and not have to have different kinds of ammo. So, um, it'd be interesting to see what it does at a longer distance. Um, I was unable to shoot any further. The range I was at was only 25 yards, so this is basically where I had to stop. But uh, it'd be kind of interesting to see what this does at a longer distance. Uh, it looks like it's opening up pretty good, so even at 30 or 40 yards, you might have to switch over to a slug if you were going to go at, you know, any further than that. But um, it's an interesting concept, and it shot pretty well. And uh, the recoil wasn't that bad. It's basically normal. And um, like I said, this is uh, three pellets and a slug coming out of one single shotgun shell. So interesting concept, shot very nicely. And again, this was from a uh, Mossberg 500 with a 20-inch smoothbore barrel. And this was the Winchester Defender ammo.